And King, the same thing goes on to Anthony Davis, a.k.a. Mr. Street Clothes, a.k.a. Mr. Glass. You're, you're playing with LeBron James. He can keep, keep himself pretty fit. He kept himself pretty fit until three years ago. And he's still spending the money. He's just getting old. Anthony, you're young, dude. Eat properly. You bleed like, well, what's wrong with that? Listen, I'm never going to disrespect him and call him street clothes, call him glass. All I could say is um, if it's something you need to do with your fitness, brother, because listen, like Sly say, I'm for the players. I respect the players. Um, and who the hell am I to sit here and call uh, a man as a champion and a few all-time all-star those type of names? Absolutely Yo, listen. Not. No, no, Absolutely listen. Not. I'm not the one that called him street clothes, No, sir. but you, you're it was still Charles, it, bro. Charles that called him you're street clothes. I'm just running with, 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 with Exactly. With you're running with it. You're running because with it. Because I see millions it. of people are going to run with it. No, no, no. But hold on. Okay. I see it. Yeah. No, I see no. it. Did, did Anthony play last night? No, listen. But listen. Mm. I said, yo, listen. He, his health has always been a problem. Right? It was, his it, health listen, has his always health. been a problem. So if it's something he needs to do to improve that, do it, Anthony. Right? Here's the thing, though, right? New Orleans, he had injury problems. Comes over to the Lakers, he's playing with LeBron. You would think that he'd still have injuries, but not the injuries that he has that seem to be reoccurring. You'd think that he would take some of the advice, soak up some of the juice from LeBron, pause, <laughs> soak up some of the aura from LeBron. And do you know what I mean? Well, well LeBron is like a, a robot, though. Like... LeBron is kind of like a different one kid. Of a kind, bro. Yeah, it's like LeBron is a different type of guy. Like he just don't, for whatever reason, he don't get hurt a lot. I do think AD. My beef with AD is not that. I just think AD doesn't play hard all the time. I'm not mad about getting hurt because that's part of the game. But I just don't think he always plays hard, and I think maybe the injuries might be a part of that actually. So I'm not. It's, I only can get on him with so much about that. But, I mean, I would, I would want him to go out there and play like he want to be the best player in the league. And that's what I don't think he does. Like, guys like KD, Giannis, they go out there every freaking night and they play like they play like they're still kids, man. AD, man, he, he's hit talent-wise, he's up there with those guys. But he don't got that same fire that, that them dudes play. Well, I see Giannis put it on AD when they went head to head. And I was shocked. I was like, God damn, like he made him look small. So I'm like, injuries, I mean, they happen. Play hard. Yo, That's my opinion. I agree with you 200 percent I don't I'm not on him for injuries. I'm on him because all season he's not been playing hard. Mm-hmm. Um one game he'll come out and he'll play good. And the rest yeah. of the game. And like you said, the man has the talent. Listen, he probably has more talent than some of these guys we just named. That's a fact. He definitely has that more skill set than Giannis, right? Mm -hmm. He definitely does. Come on, what do you mean? He has an outside three-point shot. He is mid-range. He can post up. No, no, hold on. Here's the problem, right? Hard work beats talent if talent don't work hard. That's a fact. I can't disagree with that. Absolutely. That's what Giannis is compared to AD. Yeah, but listen, AD's got all the talent in the world. Don't work hard. Yeah, but that Giannis not- didn't have all the talent in the world. Been working hard, and you've seen the development steps. R- remember me and you had this conversation last year in the Vinch. Jason Kidd is the reason why we see the Giannis we see today. What was that for AD? Well, AD is okay. It's hard. To, okay, thing with AD, right? I don't know if it's that he doesn't work hard though, because I think he works on his game. Because his game has developed. I just don't think he brings it every night. Like you know what I mean? He don't bring that competitive like fire every night. And I got my own theory on it. I don't even know if I should put it on. If I should document it. But I think part of that, I think he I got a. Sp- I want sense to the document. I want oh, to this argument. Ah, Me damn. This. But I think now that he's a Laker, he's playing with LeBron, he got a ring. I kind of feel like he 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 might kind of feel like he made it. Like I think I feel like he kind of don't play like he got something to prove no more. Like cuz remember that bubble, that bubble year, AD was looking like the next one. The next year, it's like, hold up, this ain't the same guy like sir. And I'm like, yo, hold up. Sir, it's like I'm going to give you something that me and Da Vinci always say, okay? 
I'm going to give you a little bit of context. Details. All right. Five months off. Fresh body. I know that nobody had to travel. But you give you give any NBA player of his caliber five months off and then put them somewhere where they don't have to travel. They walk to and from the gym. You're possible to see that type of outcome. Okay, but how do you explain this to him? If you remember when he was with the Pelicans, maybe maybe two years before the the title run, maybe two years. Remember, he was on a tear that year too. Remember, they they upset the Trailblazers in the first round. Yeah, remember, like it's like AD. He didn't used to be how he is now. I don't think. Like he always. You want some more context? But he like it's like I watched AD just get out rebounded and bullied a little bit, and I'm looking like, yo, this who is this guy? Like, you know what I mean? You want some more context? Yeah, give it to me. Who's he playing with? Rondo, Boogie, and Holiday. All good players that can play their role in their position. So yet again, I'm not saying AD's not good. I'm just saying AD needs, and yes, okay, we can say every player needs this. But LeBron didn't really need a whole bunch of, you know what I mean, above average superstars, especially when he was younger on his come up in Cleveland. Okay, when his two superstar players got hurt, he still took the Warriors to five games. Where do you see what I'm saying? AD didn't have any success until he had those players in New Orleans. And guess what happened? They met the Warriors, the Warriors spanked them, and AD wanted out the minute LeBron got to LA. No know. disrespect to AD. I'm not on your level, AD. I'm a guy sitting here in front of a camera talking about sports with two other fine gentlemen and we're giving our opinions and my opinion is ad you're a follower because if you look at you look at Dwayne wade chris bosh kyrie and even kevin love they all played their position may not have been the best all the time and and that literally goes to only one out of those four players i mentioned and that's kevin love Chris Bosch took a back seat willingly. Okay? Kyrie just said, okay, bro. No, you, you let me go do my thing? Cool. And Dwayne Wade had to hand LeBron the keys. But I think that's the case. I think Bron, the, the, Bron was supposed to hand the keys to AD. He's been handing, bro, the man handed him the keys and the man don't want to drive the car. And that's kind of what it seemed like. It's like, yeah. bro, you supposed to be taking. You supposed to be. We talking about when LeBron get back, bro. AD supposed to be the guy right now. It ain't. He's supposed to be holding down the fort. And I'm like, it's confusing because I thought once they won that chip, I'm thinking AD about to be an MVP candidate every year. Like, AD about to be the next guy. And it's looking like he he regressed. I think. I don't know if it is like maybe it's like a. He feel like he arrived or something. Like maybe he feel like I'm good. I got my chip. Like maybe it's that. I don't know. Yo, listen. Um, Sly said something earlier which I can't disagree with. Um, in the bubble, I saw an aggressive, feisty AD. Um, you saw him. He was ready to fight everyone in the bubble too. Word. He had that hunger in him. Um, uh, this year I completely since the start of the season I completely see a different player. Right? As a Laker fan, as a person that watches the game, it's a completely different player. And especially when LeBron James is injured, I was expecting AD to assert himself even more. Right? Take control of the team. I saw none of that. At all. Not one bit. Not one bit. With all that talent, I just think, listen, I ain't got nothing to say to you. I ain't got to call you no names. I just think, listen, you're capable of playing at a higher level of basketball. And we want to see that. And you should be playing at that. Hmm. I guess, I mean, it'll be what it'll be, man. Like, you know, at the end of the day, I'm not trying to disrespect AD. I'm just trying to put a fire in his dead ass. Pause. Um, I just I just want the man to understand that I know he's better than what he's playing. And he has an opportunity to be one of the, the, 